Welcome back y'all to Whiplash TV. Today we're back on the 1997 two-door Tahoe and we're going to put a brand new set of tires and wheels on it. This will finish murdering out or blacking out the vehicle. That doesn't mean that we're going to be done after today's video on this vehicle, but today is a major milestone of getting everything black. After my wife inherited this vehicle, this was her vision to get this vehicle completely blacked out. I agree with it. I like this look a lot. So we went for it and every single video from taking it from kind of more of a stock look to this right here can be seen right here on the channel. So be sure to check those videos out. All right, we're going to hop right into it and take a look at these wheels. All right, y'all, here are the wheels that we got for the Tahoe. We have a set of US mags. I'm going to open it up and let you check it out. But I also wanted to give you these specs. These are a 20 by 9.5 with a plus 1 millimeter offset. Hub is 78 millimeters. And of course, it's on a 5 by 127 bolt pattern. So just like I told y'all, we're going to go all black on the wheels to finish blacking out the Tahoe. So these are a two-tone black wheel. They have the gloss black lip around the outside. And then they have a matte finish on the center to kind of give it a little bit of contrast. I really like how these wheels look. I think they're going to look amazing on this Tahoe. So if y'all order these wheels for your vehicle, it's going to come with a chrome center cap. And if I didn't tell you all this little tidbit, you wouldn't know. This center cap was actually chrome along with the rest of them. And what is on here is a satin black hyper dip. I just taped them off, threw on a little satin black hyper dip, and it matches this mat really well. If I didn't tell you it was on there, you wouldn't even know. All right, I got to get these loaded up because tomorrow they're going to get wrapped in some Continental tires. I want to give a huge shout out to SoCal Wheels for being super cool to deal with on these wheels that I got and actually gave me a discount on these wheels because I have a YouTube channel and I just want to give them a huge shout out and say thank you so much for that discount. Also, here is a look at their website. Y'all be sure to go check them out if you're looking for tires and wheels. Sometimes they're hard to get. Certain other people, like my supplier at Discount Tire, can only get them in when the manufacturer actually has them in stock and they were back ordered to the end of March. So I was able to find them in stock at SoCal Wheels. And if y'all are looking for a wheel in stock that you can't find elsewhere, you might go check them out and see if they have what you're looking for. All right, let's go check out those new wheels. I had these 20 inch wheels wrapped in Continental Extreme Contact DWS 06 Plus tires in the 275-40-20 size. I compared these Continental tires to the Nitto 420V tires and a couple things you all might find interesting. These tires have a 50,000 mile warranty where the Nittos do not. Also, these Continentals in the exact same size as the Nittos 
these tires are seven pounds lighter per tire so you're talking 28 pounds of rotating weight less than the nittos so to me it's a no-brainer and they're worth the extra money they're the exact same tire i put on the cat eye chevy project truck y'all be sure to drop me a comment down below let me know how you like these new tires and wheels on this two-door tahoe and also ask me any questions that you might have if there's information that was not covered in this video and i'll be more than happy to answer any questions that you have about this setup y'all be sure to hit thumbs up and like the video y'all be sure to subscribe double check and see if you're subscribed or not I currently have over 90% of y'all watching these videos that are not yet subscribed. So I really need y'all's help to support the channel and double check and make sure that you're subbed. I appreciate y'all for watching. I'll catch y'all in the next video.